shoot the one on the right. Welcome back to African Born Adventures. On this hunt we bow hunting warthogs, but what happens next is something we hope will never get repeated again. To anyone. After a morning of close calls, we got in range of two totally distracted warthogs. And Charles was keen to put the hammer down on them. Somehow the hogs weren't disturbed by the grunt of an exploding Hoyt and it allowed me time to go back and get my bow from the vehicle. My quartering two shot passed through the sow and as she dizzily stumbled backwards I thought it was a fatal shot that she would fall over right there. And when the second sow gave me a shot opportunity, I couldn't resist trying to get it double up. I managed to release a good arrow and the pig squealed off, which then kick-started a rather interesting afternoon. Thank you. 
There's blood, blood, blood. Here he lies. There she lies. So, that is the second shot when she was facing me looking at me. I didn't have any option. I, I wanted to actually shoot her in the head, but I didn't know if that would work. Because that pig was hit just on that side of the bush and ran through here. You can see the thick blood. Go over, look there. You don't have to film it, but... That's what confused us. And definitely saw something today that I hadn't seen before. So we snuck up on this group of pigs. We were actually just looking for a place to eat some lunch. So I shot the first pig and um, I thought it was dead, the way it was moving. And so when the other pig came up to, to sniff it, I shot that pig too. And I hit it well enough that when I followed it around the corner, I snuck up to five yards from it and put in a second arrow. It, I saw it take off to the right and run into the bush. And when I walked around, because I can't go through the bush, I walked around, I got onto a blood trail. And I followed that blood trail and Charles and I Followed it now for like two hours. Eventually found a, a pig that was wounded, but it was the first pig, not this pig. So somehow those pigs ran and ran along the same path and the blood trails crossed over. And we thought that they were both gone until I just gave it one last look. I couldn't handle not having another last look because I thought I saw the, the first pig dead actually. I saw it lie down. And long story short, I came around the corner here following blood, 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 and here's the pig was lying in the bush. So, yeah, I mean, it's not ideal. We didn't get both pigs, but sometimes that happens when you're bow hunting. I don't have much more to say. So, just a thank you to the farmer, the landowner, who graciously let us come and hunt here today. It's so appreciated that we can come out of town and, 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 and hunt on your land. Thank you. Okay, so we're out here again. This year we're going to call this the redemption hunt after the Big Bang. And um, beautiful morning, slight breeze. We've got an option to chase some warthogs and some impalas. And you couldn't ask to be in a better place this morning, I think. It's going to be cracker. We've already seen a massive boar at the gate on the drive-in. I think we're going to have potential to, to have a great day out here. And this area holds a healthy population of warthog. Mm. So should be lots of stalking opportunities and um, yeah. hopefully you can come out. Well, good luck. Let's, let's send some arrows through.
I saw blood in the camera, so it looked alright to me. Yeah. Because this is a tough man. You gotta be so careful. The shot was 35. It's a little bit well further done. than I wanted to shoot, yeah. but I ran out of cover. She turned nicely. Well done. Took a bit of patience there. Eh? Well done. <laughs> Redemption shot. Well, let's find the big first. I tell you, my heart was beating harder than it's ever beaten on a bird <laughs> for that. Because your heart was in it for me, that's why. I'm so desperate for you to have put that arrow in the right spot. I just hope, it looked okay on camera, I just hope it's dead big. Cool, let's put our shoes on and go and find this thing. That looks good. That's good solid blood there. Pity about the arrow. It's the cost of bow ending it. It is, it is. You got blood. Okay. There she is. Flip the sex gonna be excited when he sees that pig. Sticking out, yeah. Hmm. Nice chompers. Charles, where are you? Yeah. I can see your pig. Is he alive? Come quickly. Come quickly. It's gonna go. <sighs> well done, bud. Ah, thanks, buddy. Over there. Yes. Okay, let's drag this thing out of here. Where are you, Thunder? Where are you? I'm missing you in action here. Perfect shot. Maybe a bit forward. With a coaching way. Mm. Should have been a little bit more of a year, maybe. Mm. That's what she went so far. So, this pig over here is a little bit of a redemption pig for me. Uh, last time we were out here, I had a little bit of a mishap with my other bow, my main bow, and uh, the string snapped. And I was lined up on a really nice pig. Um, Ryan ended up shooting that pig. I was very bleak about it. But today everything went well. Made a nice shot on this pretty decent sow at about 35 meters. She's uh, run a little, little distance. I'd say probably about 150 meters. Shot was slightly off and um, I used a decent broadhead. So I think it helped our cause. But um, yeah, here the, here's our redemption pig. Super stoked about it and uh, back on the board.